four and then this book on hold. Okay. Where do I start? <laughs> Alright. So what are you looking for me? Fiction and maybe okay. self-help uh, books too. Okay. So fiction would be in popular materials. Self-help books probably would be non-fiction up on the third mm -hmm. floor. So just go to the corner, take the elevator to the third floor, and then write non -fiction. Okay, yep. sounds good. Thank you so much. did not take a video of me going into Trader Joe's but we do have some stuff so let's do unpacking of my grocery first one is ooh, mm, dried lavender bunch this actually smells good I'm gonna put it in my display I'm gonna show you later and then my favorite pizza this one, burrata, prosciutto, arugula, so good. And this one I would eat for like half of it for lunch and then half of it for dinner. I also have this turmeric shot. Oops. <laughs> uh, lately I've been feeling a little sickly, like not full on sick, but you know, I don't wanna get sick, especially when I'm about to travel. I also have cucumber, organic cucumber for my salad. I ran out of butter, so I bought another stack. I have this sweet grape tomatoes for my salad too, because we're trying to be healthy. And lastly, okay, I did not buy a lot this week because I want to finish whatever is in my fridge. So this is. Uh, breaded chicken tenderloin breasts I love to add this to my salad if you haven't tried the chick-fil-a chicken cob salad that's my favorite salad and I'm trying to recreate it with this breaded chicken and then I also have chick-fil-a's lime avocado dressing so there's that I usually just add cucumber and the tomato but in chick-fil-a's recipe there is um, ham there's straight up cheese and corn, which I don't have right now. But normally I'm pretty happy with just chicken, the salad, tomato, and cucumber plus the dressing. So that's our haul from Trader Joe's.
I just got done walking on the treadmill and I usually stay out there to do some weights but someone's out there and I want to keep filming so we're here inside the studio which is pretty close to home. as you can see there's a door there leading um, towards the, the main gym area uh, we're just gonna do the second half of our workout here and finish off here so let's do it I also incorporate Pilates in my workout because I really like them. It's a much slower pace, but it really helps with the breathing. The focusing on breathing really helps with targeting those muscles and really feeling the burn in those areas. So I incorporate as much Pilates as I remember from going into this one studio back in New Jersey. They were giving out like free Pilates classes because they need to certify their uh, fitness instructors, Pilates instructors. So that was really nice. I got to, I think about like five free sessions from them um, and it was really helpful. I did like beginning like mat sessions and then I think bar with a wheel. That one was pretty nice because it really like extends your spine. And then there's also the reformer, which is also nice, but really difficult too yeah i i loved it i'm also trying to see if i can find pilates studios here that you know are a little bit cheaper on the cheaper side if not i can try class pass once i'm done with all my travels i'll probably gonna go and try some pilates classes here and take it with me but that's it for a night i'm gonna go back to my unit thank you again so much for tuning in and i'll see you in the next one bye